to main concept for sponsoring today's video let's go ahead and get started so this is main concept brown sugar invisible whole lace and amalfi amalfi this is what it looks like on the box and this is in the color sr1b27 so this is going to be a dark root with uh 27 um blonde like ombre so let me show you guys the stock card and we'll just go ahead and take it out of the pack. the wig looks like we have two combs in the front a comb in the back adjustable straps and then this is kind of like the frontal style soft lace and then you have your part in the middle which um well not your part but your parting area in the middle that kind of looks like a four by four so this is really really nice love this so oh yeah this looks great so it looks like i'll be able to wear this how i normally wear my unit so it does come with some baby hairs in the front as well and let's see the dark root is halfway so it looks like it comes right here and then the rest is 27 all the way down so underneath is not dark rooted in case you did want to wear it in a ponytail just so you know so the texture is silky um definitely seems to have yeah seems to have a nice density um kind of like a loose um almost like beach wave type of curl so this is different for me um, I like the color a lot. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and put it on and then I will come back and show you guys and we'll talk about the cap size and what I think about the unit. I think the unit just like plopped on my head. Literally, all I did was cut the lace and do my finger like this so I can have a part and I just wanted to come here and brush it out so you guys can see what that's going to look like. So I always, pretty much always brush out my units except if it's something that is um super um like yakky and i think it's gonna get really really big like letitia um i have a review up on that unit if you guys don't know which one i'm talking about it's really really thick um yakky texture and i didn't brush it out until after i cut it but for all my other units i pretty much brushed them out before so this is how it looks the cap is big head friendly i am using the adjustable straps because i'm trying not to glue it down um but yeah it's definitely big head friendly for sure so this is the color very very pretty and so you guys can see the difference in the sides what it looks like when it's brushed and then when it's not so just like a loose a loose natural wave and then this is what it looks like straight out of the pack so i'm gonna brush this side now i think um you can probably shift this unit a little bit and do a side part um so i may do that or you can keep it in the middle of course the like four by four square is right in the middle of the wig so the middle part would be the easiest but you could definitely probably like shift it a little bit uh to create a side part so i think i'm gonna do that not 100 percent sure we're about to see okay You guys what do y'all think i like the color a lot um i really really i love red on me more i think than i love blonde but this blonde is really pretty i like i never wear a 27 
I mostly wear 1B, so I definitely like the color a lot. And the texture is nice, and the density is really nice as well. So this is not a really thin unit. It has a nice weight to it. And it's just kind of like, maybe like 20 inches, 22 inches, like right under the boob. Pretty, pretty. So what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to have to use the hot comb just in the middle to or on my part, whichever, wherever I decide to put it. I'm um, just to um, lay it down and make sure it's flat just because it doesn't come already pre-parted. And then I'm going to see how I want to lay it down. So once I do that, I will come back and show you guys and then we'll talk about the final results. Um, the texture for one, if you guys are not new to my channel, then you already know, like all the wigs I pretty much review are, well, I won't say review, but the majority of ones that I end up really loving are yakky, either soft yakky or like super yakky coarse texture. Even the crochets that I wear are always like a thick, natural coarse texture. And this unit is super, super silky. Um, but I really, really like it. Like I think it's very pretty. The only thing that I wish is that the curls, there were a little more of them. Um, I'm going to review another unit. I don't know if this is going to go up before or after, but that unit is um, also by main concept. It's called, uh, it's called Candace. And the curls on that, I absolutely love. Um, I just wish this had just a little bit more. I love them after I brush them out. So I brush this unit out as well. I do wish it just had just a little bit more um, of a curl pattern. Not so much volume that it's like big, but just a few more curls, like especially like in this area and stuff. But overall, I absolutely love this unit. I think the color is beautiful. Um, looking at this on me, I'm like, wow, I should really start wearing blonde more. Like blonde looks really, really good. Like I gravitate towards a 1B quick, but this is really, really pretty. So um, what I did was I didn't even end up shifting the unit. So the parting space is actually wide enough for you to do a side part like this. So you can, um, you know, put it on normally. You don't have to shift it and you can still do a side part. So all I did was use my hot comb just to kind of lay it down just a little bit. And then I put a little bit of powder in there. And then I did something kind of different. Um, I took some of the baby hairs and some of them I used my hot comb to just like push them back into the hair so that it would blend. But some of them I took um, and I put a little edge control on it and I just kind of put it on top of mine, if that makes sense. Cause I did not lay this like a frontal, like I don't do that if you guys have been to my channel. So there's no glue going on here whatsoever, none at all. Um, so yeah, I'm just using the adjustable straps and then this is how it looks. So really, really pretty, you guys, really, really pretty. Um, definitely would recommend this unit if I did not say um, anything about the cap size, it is big head friendly uh, for sure. So my lace is actually completely ear to ear and actually slightly over my ear. So definitely bomb. Love that. So yeah, this is great. Um, love this unit. I don't think I have anything else to say about it. Um, if you guys have any questions um, about it, comments, whatever, let me know if you like the color too. Uh, put that in the comment section down below and I will get back to you guys. Thank you so much for watching today's video and don't forget to subscribe on your way out. Um, we will have more wig reviews coming and of course crochet will be making an appearance back very soon. Uh, so I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.